supaya bisa uh, kembali untuk tasnya. Oh yes, I forgot my my wallet. Gak bisa ini lama-lama ini harus cepat. Never break, always fight, never quit. We ride, take the game, win it life. No shame, there's no time for the pain. Whether you are living in or visiting some cities in Indonesia like Surabaya, Denpasar, you will always find many different taxis that can transport you to places you want to go. Nowadays, online taxis such as Grab, GoCar are just right on your hand. This means that you can order it from your smartphone directly. Indeed, technology makes our lives more easily. But if you don't have the online taxi application, then you may download it and see if it functions well. Online taxis are not allowed to take passengers at certain airports in Indonesia for some reason. And I'm not going to tell you why. So say when you arrive at the airport, you will see some taxi offer their services. And this can be very confusing if this is your first time arriving in Indonesia and you don't have someone to pick you up. Anyway, this video doesn't promote any of the available taxis either at the airport or in the city. However, this content is meant for a recommendation based on my personal experience. So as you arrive at the airport, you know that you are not authorized to take online taxi services or those that are not um, registered taxis. And you may wonder about which taxi should be chosen to drive you home or to your hotel. So a couple of days ago, I arrived at Surabaya Airport at night and I opted for a Bluebird taxi instead of the others. And it took me about 30 minutes uh, from the airport to my hotel in the city. I got off the taxi and took out my belongings of the boot as I arrived at the lobby of Midtown Hotel and I went to uh, the receptionist desk where I wanted to check in. The staff asked me if I could show my ID card at this moment I realized that my ID card was in a small bag and it's not with me. So I turned back to the taxi because I left it behind, but the taxi has gone. So what happened next was that, check this video. Maybe you me ice and fire. You're giving me wind Di waktu check-in, uh, kita memang harus menunjukkan uh, identitas. Jadi uh, saya meminta uh, Tuan Didi untuk uh, menunjukkan identitasnya, tetapi ternyata identitas itu tertinggal di uh, ini taksi. Taksi. <laughs> Jadi kita bantu uh, beliau untuk mendapatkan uh, informasi secepatnya dari pihak taksi supaya bisa uh, kembali untuk tasnya. So guys, um, I was super stressed. I arrived at the uh, uh, from my airport and I took a taxi, blue good. And uh, once I checked in my hotel here, Midtown, and I realized that I, this one, I forgot my uh, my Porsche, uh, my, how do you call it, bag, small bag anyway. And uh, because of uh, the receptionist asked me to, uh, to provide a, a, a ID card, then I realized, oh yes, I forgot my, my wallet in the taxi, so the taxi went away. But then, this gentleman, the driver of, of Bluebird, is very honest, so I recommend you guys, if you come to Indonesia, anywhere, uh, whenever there's a Bluebird, take a Bluebird. And my, my mistake was I didn't take his name and also the flat number, but then it was very quick accent from the uh, Midtown Hotel. So thank you very much, Pa. Thanks a lot. And you guys, you can comment. I, I really appreciate He's very honest. Thank you very much. Terima kasih banyak. Terima kasih. Terima kasih. Super, super, super good. Terima kasih. This is my life in here. I was, all, I almost cried. All my passport, my document, my yeah, you know, my valuable things is all in here. So thanks again, Pak. Terima kasih. Terima kasih banyak. Terima kasih. So, okay. Terima kasih. This gentleman, this receptionist. <laughs> Yang paling uh, membantu saya, he act uh, very quickly. Although it, it took about like two hours, but still, you know, I was like, I was so nervous. Uh, oh, how, how, how am I gonna find my my valuable things? But uh, Masuria, uh, thank you very much. Uh, you help me a lot. <laughs> go, go check, uh, go check Midtown Hotel. The guy is very helpful. 
I really appreciate your hard work today. I pressure, uh, like, I uh, give him a pressure. Come on, cannot be very long. Tapi saya ini lama-lama, ini harus cepat. Ini harus cepat karena saya takut. I'm afraid that if a taxi driver took another passenger, then I will, I will be. I don't know what, what will happen. I cannot tell because it could be the other passenger took, you know, uh, could yeah. my wallet and etc. And then, and yeah, the story will be different totally. Yeah. yeah. So again, thank you very much, Mr. Yeah. 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 I was so stressed. Yeah. Sorry, uh, long enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the process. Is it process? Process, but took like, oh come on, two hours. So, no, but yeah, this is the process. But again, I really appreciate your work. Thanks a lot, Midtown Hotel, for helping me because I don't have a local number. So that's why uh, whenever it happens to you guys, uh, my audience, if you have a same issue like me, things happen, uh, things uh, left behind the taxi. Um, like Bluebird Taxi, I would recommend that. Just uh, uh, ask uh, for help to the uh, receptionist uh, at the hotel where you stay, and then ask uh, the hotel to help you, and then they will help. If you know the number of taxi, that would be perfect. In my case, I don't know anything about this taxi. I only know that the taxi from uh, uh, airport to the hotel, and then thanks also to the uh, the, the, the CCTV, yeah. it also helped a lot. So I got everything back perfectly as I checked my document and other important documents in my bag uh, before the driver proposed me to sign on the kind of loss and found form. So I really appreciate his honesty and I rewarded him and I thank uh, the hotel staff so much for their serious work on solving out my problem. So I hope that you will find this video is meaningful and if so, please press the like button and uh, comments, share this video are welcome. Alright, um, thanks a lot for watching this video, I'm Didier Javane, see you next time. Oh, by the way, if you get on a blooper taxi, make sure you know the taxi driver's name and also the taxi's number so that it makes the tracing process more efficient if, in case you miss something. Alright, ciao!